Hey guys, it's Richard here. Today I'm going to do an unboxing of the Razer Mamba Wireless Laser Gaming Mouse. So the first thing that I notice is just the, the packaging that comes in. It's sort of like on a pedestal there. It looks really good. Um, I haven't seen any other mice packaged that way. Let's have a quick look at the tech specs here on the back. Alright, so we've got a gaming grade wireless technology, dual mode wired wireless functionality, so you can either connect via USB or use it over wireless. Uh, Razer Synapse onboard memory, so that means that you can sort of save settings on it and then take them out elsewhere and it will remember them without having to have the drivers and stuff on the computer. Uh, 5600 DPI Razer Precision 3.5G laser sensor. 100Hz ultra polling slash 1 millisecond response rate up to 200 inches per second and battery life is approximately 14 hours so that's if you're playing continuously and then 72 hours for normal gaming usage. Alright so let's actually take it out of its case and have a look at everything. So welcome to the cult of Razer it says on there. Alright, so this will be, I'm assuming, all the manuals and things like that. Alright, so we've got certificate authenticity, take control, download the drivers from their website, they don't include a CD, that's good. Uh, quick start guide, master guide, master guide for Mac, the RAID sticker, product catalog, and something that I can't understand so if you can understand what that says just leave a comment telling me all right so everything all the accessories are included in a, like a draw like sort of system here so let's take a look at this and see what's in here all right so looks like we've got the gold plated USB okay well this goes into the mouse or the uh, docking station and this end just goes into the computer so both ends there are gold plated here we have what looks like to be a battery yep so we've got a battery there and that'll be for the yeah that's the back plate coming the battery and this will probably be the charging station it's uh, Alright, so we've just got a, a pairing button on the front there and at the back you can see where the USB cable goes. Okay, so let's take a quick look at the mouse itself. Alright, so start from the side. Uh, you got two buttons there, another two here left mouse button, right mouse button, scroll wheel and scroll click. Nothing here on this side. Uh, here is where the USB cable goes in if you wanted to use it while you're playing and while it's charging. Uh, on off, so I'm guessing that's for the wireless on or off. And that's where the battery goes. Uh, another pair button and here we have an eject so I am assuming that's for the USB cable. Alright, so um, I'm going to give this mouse a test for a couple of days and then I'll have a video review up. I'm um, just telling you what I think about it. So stay tuned for that. 